Today is the 19th of May. 2024, the final day of the Premier League season. Arsenal just just blew it. I mean, they won against Everton, but they blew it again. For the second year running, Arsenal managed to throw any sentient being they could have of winning a Premier League title in a toilet. And now I'm here with them because guess what? The algorithm has to love me. So if Mikel Arteta, former Pep's assistant and visionary tactician, couldn't win Arsenal the league, how about someone that is in their 20s and lives on someone's basement? Uh, how is that for you? Yeah, today's about winning the league with Arsenal. And if I don't win the league with Arsenal, I have to eat a spoon of hand sanitizer. I thought the fourth is already done once we saw John sniffing salt, but apparently that's just the beginning of the fun. Yeah, your concept of fun is quite amusing. I'm, I'm kind of a psychopath, so I don't have a concept of anything. Wait, you have sweet on your team? We're salty, ha <laughs> I get it, the opposite of sweet is salty. I am going to have to die of laughter, even though I wanted to die of hunger. Laughing, 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 laughing. Yo, that, that joke was so good, like, we should have a party. Laughing, 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 laughing. Make sure you get chips, not rice. I've been dead for six months, you melons. The caveat here is Mifil was sorted because his 83s pass all around in 287s. Full line, not by much. Unless we have money to buy a striker. Centre backs were sorted. Both of these lads are young, but overall they don't need to worry. Goalkeeper is a bit of trauma. And I think I'm thinking of a German. A sweet, sweet German. And obviously, uh, two new fullbacks. We can't be trying to win leagues with these two in our team. That's goodbye to you. Stay or go. He has to go, blood. He has to go, blood. Money talk. They we actually have quite decent money. They suggested Darwin. Our scouts don't really get how this works, do they? This wouldn't be a career mode video from the tw three twats without getting budget keepers on a free to suck our cocks. And Onoya, again, just like the Ipswich video and the Ipswich thumbnail, he's with Arsenal now, trying to win a league that he has no business playing on. Alright, let me explain to the people then. Uh, the manager's name is... Just show for the camera, please. That's not the manager's name. Yeah, can someone make a petition online for me to stop making these names? Please. You shouldn't sell to the competitor. Yeah, why should I sell you, m my African got child? On the other hand, Reese Nelson going to Crystal Palace it just seems like the right thing to do. South London, he is dark skinned. He will fit right in. 50 million for Ramsdale by Roma. Tasty, tasty bait. But I think we can get more. Up that by 10 and take the 900,000 off. <laughs> they actually accept. <laughs> I don't think they have that many options. They have. Rui Patricio and go. You should be already trying to buy some players. You still have a hundred million. Nah, I want to sell more. Let's see how this train goes. Fabio Vieira to, um... Mmm... They paid much more for him to come. <laughs> come. I'm not gonna send him to Spurs, I'm not a fucking idiot. I mean, it doesn't matter where you go, you're gonna be shit anyway, Cedric. Not you. You stay for as long as you can. You're stuck to London, you're never gonna leave. They're saying that we can get 63 million out of Ben White. I'm gonna be nice to you, and I. 58 million is a pretty good shout. He goes for it. These lot are too dumb. Uh, I'm assuming they aren't questioning the value. They are just saying, yes, I'll buy him for that price. Means that you were the stupid one, probably. You have to know business 101. Drag the price up and they still pay because they're there for one reason. They're not going to leave if they don't get what they paid for. Yeah, but if they don't even think about it, that means that it was too cheap, which means the stupid one. It's you. That's what you're mistaken with business 101. Listen, listen, I went to business school. I got this in the bag. Where was this business school? Africa. Because they've been doing pretty well. No. Mongolia. Oh, and they are, have a great business down there, don't they? Uh, excuse me? You are doubting the seventh best supplier of rice in the world? Oh, seventh. I mean, in Asia. I mean, in Central Asia. All right, all right. All right. Can you answer me this question? Am I homeless? No, I guess. But I'm going to be. But now, I'm not homeless. Business. Play the game. He's a nice little boy, and I suck. And I sucked his cock once. You're gonna see right now that the game is gonna recognize my game for business, and it's gonna give me a good grade for the signing. Fuck. Yeah, but they refused to sell me Robertson. What are my, what are my chances with Trent? Plus, Di Lorenzo is handsome. He has a handsome mustache. See, now it's too much tension. How about 67.5? How about 57.5? See, they're gonna think about it. Business. As a person that plays a lot of FIFA, you know that when they say, I'm gonna think about it, it means, no, fuck off, asshole, pay what I said. 
<laughs> he said no. Business. Business, yeah? Shut up, shut up. No, no, shut, shut up. I was just unlucky because he's Asian. So instead of seeing 140, he saw 14,000. So the only rational decision is wait a week and try again. Oh, sign Ozzy, man. Fine, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make you happy a bit. How about 55 million? A sell on course that will make baby cry and a player swap, swap for guess what? Guess what? For the other right back that for some reason hasn't sold yet. That is too much. Okay, how about for the Asian guy that nobody likes? Man said realistic offer, business. That was still a bit too much, but at least you didn't do very stupid as per. That's 5,000 less and we get Giovanni Di Lorenzo from Napoli for 55 million plus Takeda Tomiyasu. I bet you the grade will be, the grade is not better than a C. And now it's gonna say, I did an amazing job. I did an amazing job, just, just say it. Yeah. He's handsome, he's handsome. You cannot put price on beauty. Without 300 million, yeah, it's all gone. Yeah, every single bit of the money is gone. The black man who wears the mask and got nice hair, Victor Aussie man from Napoli, for a price that shouldn't be fucking legal. C! I got C! I got a fucking C! I graduate! Fuck you! I mean, D is also graduate, so I don't understand your point. Ah, brother, we can, we can always generate more cash. Look at all this fucking dead weight just presenting on our bench. But you need a bench. Tony Cruz, our final signing. 54 million from Real Madrid. It's better than Jorginho. Even if he decreased the rating, we still got midfielders on the bench. It's fine. And all of a sudden, this squad looks a lot fucking healthier. This is more like it. Now that I don't have to be using fucking Ipswich or teams or or overachieving teams with shit squads and finally see results like this Crystal Palace be nice to me haha <laughs> fuck um, win against yeah Fulham. yeah it's, it's Fulham. Fulham at least it They're was amazing against full salami <laughs> wow Wow. PlayStation, can you stop fucking notifying me? I know. I can get good deals on games. I have a life outside of this fucking console. And it's called prostitution. Uh, what did I say about Son? Uh, John. What did I say about Son? If we get him on a cheap, that's a lot cheaper than us, you meant, uh, maybe stuff like this wouldn't happen. I feel like I'd just fall better if we simulate it straight away and don't, don't stop to manually simulate this shit. I let God roll. And he gave me shit in a fucking basket. At last, fucking beat one of the top six. Jesus. We might actually consolidate ourselves as not even on the running. We might not even get top four in this shit. I mean, I think if you win Champions League, that's not bad. Though. For whatever reason, they like me for now. So not even a goal against Burnley. And then, and then carry on for my own monologue. Now we beat Brentford. Die in a fucking hole. Die in a fucking hole. Why haven't you killed yourself yet? Because you keep me going. Why? You be asking yourself that? Very transfer window and Man City are completely out of sight. And we're not even second, we're behind Liverpool because of that defeat. Third consolation, I guess. Still five points away from Man City, but let's be honest, once March and April arrives, we're gonna be 12 points away from them and having every single one of our insecurities become true. Fuck you. Fuck your team. Fuck Liverpool. Fuck everyone. I don't like humans. No, no, no. I, I like humans. I, I swear I like humans. No, no. I, I love the shit out of them. I love their skin. I, I love. I love how they they, they have sex. I, I promise. I love humans. Don't don't even lose to look to fucking Orin. I love humans. I love. I, I, yeah, yeah. I love humans. Go humans all the way. I love humans. Man City, please fucking stop. Leave me alone. It's a League Cup final. You should have no business cup partaking in this competition you take on strong competition okay don't come here on the playground that is the carabao cup and then have your shit in front of my fucking eyes it doesn't matter if i like humans or not they, they keep on fucking beating us it's february and it's done it's february it's, it's all done it's, it's all cut to shit this is what a defeat to crystal palace makes us do it sends in the snowball effect that we can't even beat west ham and we need Fucking three goals to be Burnley. Oh, I think this is a good time to ask. What do you think hand sanitizer has a taste like? I'm gonna eat your ass one day. I'm not gonna tell what day. I'm not gonna even tell you when I'm gonna do it and how I'm gonna do it and where I'm gonna do it. But I'm gonna eat your ass one day. It's gonna be filthy. There'll be blood everywhere. Yeah! On the fucking playground that is the League Cup, masquerading itself as a glorified competition. Rodri gets sent off. One of the most calm men in football gets sent off. 
in a final. And we beat them 3 2 to win a trophy. Why couldn't I have just said, yeah, I win a trophy with Arsenal, something they haven't done in four fucking years, and then I, I, I don't have to drink hand sanitizer for a yeah. chimney? <laughs> yeah, you. Uh, oh, that's funny. You care about everything yeah, except funny. the league. It's crazy. Uh, let, me, let, let me pick up my mic for a bit. 10 points behind Liverpool is just not a case of how, how can we win the league now. It's just how much can we embarrass ourselves until the, until D-Day arrives and I have to drink something that was made to clean your hands. I mean, you're one game behind. Oh! Oh! Why, why didn't you say so? It's like, it's like I'm a new man. I'm a completely different man because of it. Thank you very much. And now you draw. Now you choose the best time to fucking draw with the best club in the world. Yeah! Yeah! So people joked about Liverpool only winning the Carabao Cup and the only thing you're going to win is the Carabao Cup. Yeah, it's guaranteed now. Um, so that means I don't have to drink hand sanitizer. Look, we're going to beat Man United as well. I'm not in denial. I'm just really confident. And I'm not getting sacked. See, we beat Man United. There's nothing to worry. I am completely fine with this whole situation. And now we're going to beat Everton. Wait, I'm just put the simulation on. Yeah. And now we're going to beat Everton. Oh, look at that. We get a draw. Sacre bleu. I, I am kind of mad, but not too mad. After all, we did get top four. We probably got third. I'm going to check. Oh, we did. Yeah. 76 points. That's so good when you spend 250 million on a bunch of players that couldn't deliver. But look, the squad is so nicely put together. The front line is great. And Manuel Neuer is pushing 40 and close to death. We're so good at football, guys. Come on, I'm not in denial. Oh, yeah. Arsenal scored 30. That's brilliant. Martinelli also scored 27. And Saka scored 22 and assisted 17. Wow. That is brilliant, you guys. You did an amazing job. I'm proud of every single one of you. Look at that. Manuel Neuer is so good, even for his age. Down 57 games, he kept 10 <laughs> clean sheets. 10. Wow! This little guy gives me so much joy and doesn't make me want to stick my face in a fucking vacuum. Do you see this? It's hand sanitizer. It says read the instructions. If you go behind and read the instructions, it said, don't fucking eat it. You're going to die. I cannot believe I'm gonna do this. <laughs> don't worry, it's just a tiny spoon of it. I cannot say with a straight face that I don't want to die because this is my reality. I created this forfeit. <laughs>